hello everyone welcome back to the channel my name is courtney ann wallace and on this channel we discuss business finance and real estate i'm here with another adventure in the maryvale avenue in the kingston 8 section where i'm going to be touring some brand new apartment complexes for sale there are some specs about the complex however if you need additional details they're in the description box below to stay in the loop about real estate projects and upcoming developments, subscribe to the channel and also follow me on Instagram. Now let's get into the tour. Welcome to the DeAndre Estate by Leading Edge Construction. These two bedroom, two bathroom units are going fast. So if you're interested, contact the real estate agent below. The units are open concept and they're actually very neatly designed. I did notice that when I was doing the tour. Here, we're gonna start with the kitchen area, which is an open concept kitchen. And as you can see, it is extremely aesthetically pleasing with an earth tone color scheme and flows directly into the living room area. There's tons of cabinet space, tons of counter space as well, and also room for your different kitchen appliances. notice there's a gap between the cupboard and storage cabinet and that is to allow for your stove and I'm just gonna turn around and show you the left side of the kitchen because it has a similar setup here so here there's like a half of an island or a quarter island that can allow for two chairs and then there is your cabinet space here and then a second gap but this one is much taller and wider and obviously this one would be of course for your refrigerator Next, I'm going to prop open those cabinets so you can get a glimpse of what the inside is like. I think they're very spacious, especially the corner cabinets because they go all the way back and also given the height of the cabinets. Also, please take note of all of that counter space, the beautiful backdrop. Now, unlike the Lakers Manor video I did the other day, this backdrop is the same in every unit. This kitchen also has double sinks, which you guys know I love and stainless steel double sinks at that and then in addition to that as well the name of the subway tiles if you're interested in putting this inside your home is actually subway tiles now back to the cabinets instead of frosted glass they did go ahead with transparent glass and i noticed they had sort of a baseboard for lack of a better word for your sink to safeguard against maybe water spillage now the drawers in the kitchen are also extremely deep like i said guys the cabinet space is just immaculate the drawers are deep the cabinets on the walls are huge and of good height and so you have a lot of storage in this kitchen even under your sink there is storage as well so you're never going to be short of space i have not seen braided crown molding in a while and I really like it it really was a breath of fresh air and honestly it brought the whole living room area you know some sorts of details here or there that really gave the space a vibe this is your storage closet and it's gonna be flowing from your guest bathroom just so you can understand the layout of the house that's your guest bathroom there that's your kitchen over there and then once you turn around you have your storage closet so this the storage closet is not in your bedroom it is out in the open and then here as well there is a second door and this is actually where your laundry room is going to be and as you can see the fixtures are there so it's really just for you to install your washing machine and your dryer you know maybe a little sink or whatever it's really spacious the ceilings are really high as well and I like it I, I think it's a very spacious room and that flows or brings us right into the bedroom area so if you notice I went through a door just now so your closet is in the bedroom so that is the storage closet that I mentioned that's the laundry room door and then the one that is open right here is now inside the bedroom and this is going to be your master closet so you can install shelves here shoe racks anything possible really and then it brings us directly into the master bedroom really loving the tiles for this unit i also love the windows i noticed that the windows nowadays in the units have um, less sills i think that's what they're called it's really just the open glass and i think it's very 
very subtle and nice now let's look take a look into the bathroom as you can see guys this complex is still under construction so sorry about the mess however bear with me and try to see the vision double sinks his and her sinks actually mirrors for both sinks as well a huge bathroom and it's actually gonna have both a shower and a jacuzzi you see how large that shower is already and then the jacuzzi is also equally large right so the jacuzzi is gonna be here in this area and don't mind my superpowers that's just me doing my thing on camera yes i have powers guys i'm kidding it was just the wind but the jacuzzi is gonna be in that corner and as you notice this bathroom has a lot of windows like when i was in the bathroom i couldn't help but notice the breeze i was like oh my god this bathroom is so cool there's a lot of breeze and a lot of natural lighting and you know living in jamaica we have a very warm climate so that's super important as well also i can imagine a decent night shower in this bathroom with all of this space because even when the jacuzzi will be installed i'm looking at the floor plan or the size of the bathroom rather and you still have a lot of space now once we're wrapped up with the master bedroom and bathroom we're gonna head into bedroom number two bedroom number two also has a ensuite bathroom which we will see shortly it also has a closet it's not a walk-in closet like the previous one but it is still an equally spacious closet with overhead storage and so forth. Now, if you notice, I'm giving you a 360 just to keep you guys consistent with how the house is laid out. So this is the closet here. This will be your overhead storage at the top. All of that will be covered. And this is me standing on the other side of the bedroom so that you can have an understanding of where I just came from. So let's take a double take on that space. So it's through the door. On my left, it's not on camera now, but on my left is bedroom number two. The kitchen is in front of me. The living room is right there. And then that door behind the kitchen is gonna be your bedroom. Now, you notice the doors earlier in the living room that actually brings you to a small balcony area where you can maybe have a coffee table, some chairs, those hanging chairs are really nice as well and they are trending and they are cute and you can install any one of these here and just relax get some work done or even have a view of the city here i was just having a chat with miss daniels she's a real estate agent and we decided to take a look of, at some of the construction activity that was happening on the property now guys all this time i thought trees were planted but i was wrong so i actually filmed this guys just for you in case you're watching this and you did not know either so apparently the trees come ready made and are put into the ground using a series of workers and machinery spoilers one of the three them did break but you know these things happen at construction sites so we move nevertheless the other tree was installed and it was fine now let's head upstairs and view the pool area and entertainment area so when you go upstairs there will be a public bathroom this is it right as you come up the stairs so you don't necessarily have to go back to your apartment to use the bathroom lovely views lots of gusty winds very cool and elevated and the pool is to die for I don't know how I can stress this enough living in Jamaica having a pool it's literally one of the best combos you can ever have it really brings off that island living and that island experience this is the entertainment area where as you notice it's covered so you can maybe host family gatherings here games nights uh, friend socials you know friend link ups anything really and this is me standing on the other end of the entertainment area so you can have an idea of where the pool is where i walked from so that's the stairs right there and then the view of the city was just absolutely amazing here they were installing tree number two and this one went ahead smooth sailing it did not break 
but you know what guys thank you so much for watching yet another video if you have any comments or questions remember to check the description box below reach out to miss antoinette daniels she is the real estate agent and i will see you guys in the next property tour goodbye